I've been a king and I've been about mine. Never could doubt mine. They running the route. I leave them outline when I hear them. EA Sports coverage of the NFL has us at the foot of the Rockies just west of downtown Denver at Empower Field at Mile High. The it's unlike any other in sport as both teams made their way out of the tunnel. These folks are fired up as their guys are ready to do battle between the Houston Texans and the Denver Broncos. And beyond the 20, but not by much. In fact, just a yard pass there to the 21. The Texans take over first and 10 at their own 22-yard line. This is Aaron Jones. And if there was a lane there, it closed up quickly as he stopped for no gain. Second down. Delayed give there out of the gun. Defense was ready. And I'm not a big fan of a draw play out of the shotgun formation because the quarterback's not having much action where he's getting away from the line of scrimmage. He's catching the football, making a little head fake, and then handing it off. You should be able to read it as they did there. Officially nothing on that last run. They'll try again second and ten. Now Jones, and he'll take this one up close to the 25-yard line. Two runs in a row, but only two yards to show for it. It's a gain of two yards, and it's third down. A tough spot here on their opening drive. This is third and seven. Gun Watson. And he's got Lockett. And able to rip off a big chunk of yardage before being dropped inside the 40. That's a gain of nearly 40 yards on third and medium to pick up the first. The Texans first down. So how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. From the shotgun again to Jones. And he's brought down at the 34. Call it a gain of four. I feel like I could see what he was thinking on that carry. He wanted to follow that big tackle through the hole. Ended up only getting four yards on the carry. I think he had designs on that one being bigger. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. Out of the shotgun, it's Jones. And this time he's not going anywhere. They'll get him down. The play there, so they're left with a third down and six. Brings up third down. A 
A shotgun snap for Watson. Open man, it's Allen. And he is going to have a Texans first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. A gain of nine, nine yards that time. First down, Texans. Jones. And not much. Maybe a yard down to the 23. Aaron Jones on the carry. Yeah, things were pretty stacked up there in the middle of the line. A lot of bodies, not much space. I think ultimately he was fortunate to get anything out of that run. The run only got a yard. Here's second and nine. They'll fake the handoff. Now Watson. And they're going to get him. He sacked back around the 28. One thing they definitely like about this youngster is his motor. He is full throttle on each and every snap. Love to get after the quarterback, and that has to feel good to him right there. His first career sack. Going to need something special here on third and long. After that sack, what does Watson have in his arsenal? From the gun, here's Watson. He'll lock it with a grab over the middle. And he takes it down to the 10-yard line. They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. Now Jones. And he'll take this from the nine down to about the seven. The ball carrier. Not a whole lot there. The defense was ready, it looked, for that run-pass option. You get the sense the next time he has that opportunity, he may keep it himself and get to the perimeter. Probably owes his back a little bit of an apology on that one, huh? The line of scrimmage, the seven now on second and goal. And he's going to press this one forward as they stop him right around the one. A nice run there as he picks up six. It's going to be third and goal now. They'll try to run in with Jones. And Jones is not going to have the first down as they stop him short. It'll be a loss of one, and that will bring up an interesting decision here on fourth and goal. Two-yard line. Now with the play clock about to expire, we get a whistle and a timeout. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. And on their first drive, the offense staying out there. They're going to go for it on fourth. They'll go with Jones. And he'll wind up being knocked back to the three-yard line. From the two. And on the opening drive of the ball game, the defense comes up with a goal line stand. Try to get forward, but he's going to be stopped in his tracks at about the three. He was brought down by Ross Blacklock on the tackle. No gain on the play. Brings up second and ten at the three. So after the run for no gain, here's second and ten. Lock going to hand it off here to Gordon. 
Well, that gives him a little room, but not much. A gain of two to the five. And this is why aggressive defense coordinators love to blitz. It wreaks havoc because they end up taking their attention to the blitzers and freed up the D linemen to make the play. They'd like to avoid punting from their own end zone so they could use something here on third down. And he's brought down, but not before they get it across the 20-yard line. Solid gain of 18 yards and a Denver first down. First and 10 at the 23-yard line. We're scoreless after one. Quarter with no score. Second quarter about to begin from Denver. It's the Broncos in possession of the football as they've got it with a first and 10. Gordon. And they're able to get this one across the 35. A good gain again. That's now 31 yards combined on those last two plays. That was good, tough running right up the middle. And if the defense can't penetrate and make him slow his pace or change direction, that's often the end result. So from the 36 now, first and 10. Here's Locke to throw. Out quickly to Judy. And he'll be down deep into Houston territory. A big play there on the catch and run. 56 yards. At the nine yard line. So first and goal from the nine yard line. First and goal, Melvin Gordon. And the Broncos are going to have a first and goal forthcoming as he takes this down to about the five yard line. So that run gets him about halfway home. Yes, yeah, now second and goal. The end zone beckons. It looms. They can do whatever they want. Full playbook. Run it again, or they can go play action and try and put it in that way. Second down and goal. Lock. Flush to his right. His pass caught at the four. No and he'll take it into the end zone for a Denver score. Texans offense ready to go here for their next drive. And last time out, went for it on fourth down, turned it over, gave them great field position, turned it to six points, so they've got to recover here, Charles. It's amazing what one decision can do in the chain of events, right? The decision to go for it on fourth down, it caused every bit of it, but it showed confidence. Hey, I've got confidence in you guys. Go pick it up for them. Didn't happen. Also showed confidence in the defense. They didn't pick up their end of the bargain, so now they've got to come back out and start over and re build that confidence. Let me 
explain what I did. Can I kick it? Hold on. Yeah, I got some rings and a range. Can I kick it? Yeah. Don't ask me a thing. How I got her, how I did it. Yeah. Spend the whole half, had a blast. Can I kick it? Yeah. Even with a sprain.